Now, Lilia Kovalova's been part of the Strictly family since Series 2. She's been in the final twice and claimed the trophy once. But what about life before Strictly? This is her Strictly Dance Life. <laughs> I actually started dancing at the age of four. Growing up in Russia, people take things quite serious. You know, I was always a very, very serious child. I always wanted to make a career out of it. When I was about 11, I think, there was a top couple that came to Russia to do demonstrations, and the names were Sammy Stopford and Barbara McCall. When I moved to England, they became my teachers, so it's kind of a weird thing, like destiny. <laughs> I've always been very successful as a competitor. First of all, I was USSR 10 dance champion and ballroom and Latin. But then, you know, eventually as I moved to England and started dancing with Darren, we've run lots of things together. Lily and I were introduced by my brother. We were both available. We hadn't got partners at the time. When Lily and I started to dance together, we were very, very successful. We were under 21 champions. We won the British Close, then we won the international championships as well, which is one of the major world championships. The year that Darren and I turned professional, we were very, very successful and we started making all the finals. Um, so, you know, it, it was a good move for us. And then we were married about 20 months later after meeting. We were asked to take part in the second series and initially our answer was no. Um, but then all of our family got together and they got us very drunk and they said you will do it. <laughs> Dancing the cha-cha-cha will Alec Jones and his partner Lilia Kopilova please take to the floor. Once we started doing that we were hooked and of course Darren won in the first series that we took part in. And of course in the third series Darren Goff and I won which was absolutely fabulous. But then Darren said right now you won I have to beat you again. So we have this kind of secret rivalry going between us. <laughs> One of Lilia's great traits as a teacher is her headstrong will to drive her celebrities as far as she possibly can. Make this one good. That was rubbish. You know, taking Darren Goff, Matt Dawson, Alla Jones, Dominic Littlewood and Don Warrington and having done very well with all of them. If there's anything there, she'll find it. I remember the first time I met Darren Goff uh, and I walked in and I thought, oh my God, seriously. He looked a bit like a wardrobe. She used to come home from the first couple of weeks in training going, oh, I'm out early this year. I don't think we're going to get through week one. And he was very scared to start with. He was very embarrassed by it all. Chunky, lumpy, really, really nasty. Lilia did a magnificent job with Darren Goff, that series. I mean, he started out appallingly. He actually became a pretty good dancer towards the end. And when we won, it was just absolutely incredible because I think for someone like Darren Goff to start from pretty much nowhere and then to go on and win it, I think it was probably one of the biggest journeys ever on Strictly Come Dancing. Hopes for the future, you know, to, to be dancing, first of all, to be dancing with a person that I like and that I get on with. For example, this year with Don Warrington, it was great because we really got on well. Maybe, you know, with a little bit of dance ability, that wouldn't go miss. But, you know, you can only, you can only wish, can't you? And that was my Strictly Dance Life.